What is going on everyone? Got a tech video here to share with all of you on how to transfer your pictures and videos from your Android phone over to your Windows 10 PC. Maybe you're trying to copy them off of your phone to free up some storage, put them over on your laptop or your desktop computer. So the phone I got here is Galaxy Note 10 Plus 5G model. I went ahead and took a photo and I took a little video there. I'm gonna show you how to move them over or delete them from the phone if, if you want to. But what you need to do is basically take the cable that came with your phone, okay? You just wanna go ahead and connect your device, just like that. And you're probably, if you're doing this for the first time, you're probably gonna get a pop-up on your screen that says allow access to your data, okay? To use the uh, media transfer protocol. What you wanna do here is just simply choose allow. Now, if you're doing this and you don't get a pop-up, you should be able to scroll down up here, all the way down, and you should see something in here that says like Android system USB for file transfer. You can go ahead and select that right there and you go ahead and tap that. Basically, that screen there is where you can choose this one here to transfer files from your device. So now, if I disconnect the cable, and I plug it back in, I'm no longer going to get that allow access pop up. Okay. So where you find it then is like I said, right down in here, you just go ahead and select that and then choose that. You can choose what you want to do and how you control the USB connection down here. So now that we're in the phone, we're going to jump back to the screen here on the computer and I'm gonna go ahead and go on this icon here. It says this PC and under your devices and drives, you should get a, a pop up here where it says Galaxy Note 10 plus 5G. If you double click that, now again, if you, if you double click that and this area here is completely blank and it says, you know, nothing to be found and you know you have stuff on the phone, try to jump back to the phone, scroll down from that settings area, go back into this USB file thing, make sure you choose this one here, transfer files. It's normal for it to show that there's no files because that's how the system is set up. It wants you to manually tell it that it's okay for you, that you're allowing it to transfer your stuff over. So if I go ahead, I slide this over a little bit, I'm gonna go ahead and double click that. And the folder that you're looking for normally where everything is stored is in this one here called the DCIM folder. So you can double click that. That gets you into your camera app. And right there is the uh, video file and my picture file. So what you can do here is if you wanna free up storage on your phone, you can highlight these, you can right click, and you can choose to cut or copy. If you choose to cut the files, they will actually be removed from your phone and you can paste them over on the computer. But right now I'm just gonna select copy because I just wanna go ahead and copy them over. So what you wanna do now is just open up a new folder, like your pictures folder, you wanna double click that, go in there. Then in somewhere in the blank space area here, or you can go up here and choose paste. You just wanna right click and choose the little paste option and that will move the files over just like that. Now the files have been moved over to my computer and when I click on them, you can see it moved the video files or the video file there and the JPEG or whatever your images are. And now they're in this folder on my computer called pictures, but they still are left on the device. So if you wanna remove them from the device, you can choose to delete from here like that, you can select them and choose to delete. That will free up your storage on your phone again. Some of us want to copy on our phone and some of us want to safe copy over on our system, like if we have a laptop or something like that. So that is pretty much all I got for you. So there you go. I hope this video was helpful to you guys. If it was, hit the good old like button and share the video. See you guys next time.